Lord. Hallelujah. Good morning, my dear friends in Christ. We begin this Sunday reflection in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Today is the 28th Sunday in Ordinary Time, year A. And we thank God for being alive in the land of the living. Thank you, Jesus. Our reading for today is from the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 22, from verse 1 to 14. We will consider the topic that is also a question. Are you invited to the marriage feast? Our master has been talking to us in parables in the last few weeks. The last few Sundays, the Lord has been talking to us in parables. And today, he is also telling us in parable about a man who prepared a big wedding party for his son and invited many guests, many personalities, many important personalities. We call them the VIPs. All these people that were invited did not show up. All the people that were originally invited, they never showed up. They gave what, what we may consider as genuine excuses, which had to do with the, their businesses or their career. A lot of us today give many excuses for not serving God as we should. We even use the blessing that God gave us as excuses for not serving Him. We give excuses about how busy we are at work. We give excuses about how our family responsibilities are taking our time. Many of us are guilty of these excuses. Let us honor the invitation of God even when it is not um, convenient for us. Let us prioritize the things of God. The things of God should come first in our lives. May the Lord help us in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Since the original people have excuses for not attending the feast, the man later had to invite other people so that the food will not be wasted. Many of the people that were invited later then showed up. The people that were now invited now showed up. But there was this particular man that was at the venue he was not wearing a wedding garment and he was bundled out of the venue our master later concluded the parable by saying that many are called but few are chosen let me ask you are you invited to the wedding feast prepared by god for his people god has made abundant provisions for man to enjoy as he invites us to come into his relation to have a relationship with him through our Lord Jesus Christ. Have you accepted the invitation to become a member of God's family through salvation in the, the Lord Jesus Christ? We have all been invited, but very few people have showed up by accepting Jesus as their personal Lord and Savior. It is a call, and we are all to respond we have to respond to the invitation for many are called but few are chosen are you among the few who have responded to god's invitation imagine the total population of the world out of this number how many are christians how many do you find in church who attend masses regularly are you at the feast with your garment of salvation? Some people come to church just for social benefits, what they will benefit. Some people come for contact, some people come for connection. I, some ladies, yes, some people even come to copy styles in the church. What did you come to do? You are there to come and seek God in his face, to get the salvation of the Lord. It is by this that we are truly honored that we truly honor God's invitation and be part of the feast with our garments of salvation. Child of God, the Lord is calling on us to wear our garments of salvation. You can be among the few that are chosen. Yes, you can be among the few that are chosen. So don't allow your work, your family, your business, your career, or whatsoever reason to carry you away from your God. Don't allow anything to carry you. Many of us today are carried away. Many of us today 
are carried away because of our work and responsibilities we have and not putting God first. The things of God should be our priority. I pray for you today that we will honor God's invitation to the feast of his son and that we will be among the few that is chosen that will attend the feast with our garments of salvation through Christ our Lord. Amen and amen. May the Lord help us to wear the garments of salvation. May the Lord help us to answer the call, to honor the invitation. The Lord is calling you. As you are re- listening to this message, have you been called? Have you accepted him? Honor that invitation. Come to Jesus. Wear your garment of salvation. I pray that the Lord will help us. Receive that grace now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. Happy Sunday. And have a fruitful week ahead. You are highly blessed. Amen. Thank you, Jesus.